Hey, what's up guys? My name is Cameron Gallagher and as you can see, that is me. <laughs> so I wanted to show you guys a really cool video about DaVinci Resolve and how you can do something called dynamic switching, uh, dynamic project switching. And this is really interesting and it's quick, but I never knew that you could do this and I just feel like this is gonna come in handy and it already has. So right now I have a project open where I'm doing the A-roll for a uh, light that I'm doing a review on, which actually probably gonna come out before this video. Um, but I want to go grab a B-roll clip that I have in another project that I use the light with. So typically you'd go, you'd have to pull it in, blah, 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 do all that stuff. But the problem is I did a lot of color work to it and I really don't want to have to go back and either export a lot or something or whatever. So all you have to do is go down to the project little home button there. We're going to see all the projects and I'm just going to right click on this and click uh, dynamic project switching. So that's all you got to do is just turn that on right there like that. And now that is on. So we're going to go to our Quasar Science tube and we're going to open that up. Now what this is going to allow us to do is open up both projects at the exact same time. So granted, this is going to take more processing power. So you can see it's taking a little longer to load this project. And remember, it's going to take more out of your computer, but this is awesome. Now you can see up here, if you want to know if you're in this or not, the Quasar Science Tubes, um, it has this little drop down arrow and you can see, boom, there's a Mix Pre 3. So I'm going to copy this, copy, go over here, Mix Pre 3. We're going to switch projects. Again, my computer is probably going to crap its pants quick. And then I'm going to paste and everything is going to have copy and pasted over. So you could do this, whoops, you could do this in any portion of the uh, anything. So I'm just going to paste it, I'm actually going to put it over here, then paste it, and boom, there is my clip, it just got imported, and the assets just got imported in there, look at that, so that's dynamic project switching, and if you want to just turn it off, because you don't want it to be killing your, you know, computer, just turn off dynamic project switching on that project, it'll close it out, and then you're good to go, boom, so anyway guys, thanks for watching, hope this was helpful, and I'll catch you guys later.